The game began with a little up, one-upsmanship by the Michigan Wolverines. They took the field last, contrary to tradition. So Notre Dame in the unaccustomed position of coming onto the field first, struck first in the game. Took a field goal off the opening kick. Then Ron Paulus hit Lee Becton for a touchdown. Bianca Batuka with a 10-yard touchdown run for the Michigan Wolverines. Todd Collins of the Wolverines hitting Bianca Batuka. Then a key play late in the second quarter. Lee Becton stripped by Clarence Thompson of the Wolverines. First turnover of the game, resulting in a Michigan field goal. And at the end of the first half of play, Wolverines and the Irish tied at 10. down. Great defensive play by Kerwin Waldrop, the outside linebacker. He wrapped up Paulus immediately. Battle between the two schools. Ron Paulus made a visit to Michigan. Here right away, he said it wasn't for him. Here, Miller. Miller is to the 20. That'll be another Irish first down. Irish drive. Paulus again is dragged down. Steve Morrison came on a blitz from his inside linebacker spot, and before Paulus had a chance to do anything with the football, Morrison took him down. The good man would never allow anyone to be in for five years in a row. Paulus taken down again. For safety, and a pass knocked down. And a flag, a very late flag comes in. Tyrone Noble will be called for pass interference. whose pass interference set up the touchdown. Mark Edwards, two-time Ohio back of the year out of Norwood, just outside of Cincinnati. Big block there by Ryan Leahy on Tony Henderson to spring Mark Edwards for the go-ahead touchdown. Grandfather passed to the and Ryan was only one, but he used to go to his grandmother's house in the Notre Dame Park Zone for ice cream money. Reimersma takes the pass from Collins, and he'll have a Michigan first down. Gain of 11 yards. And a... Collins it to Reimersma. Short gain to the Irish 49-yard line. It'll be third and long for Michigan. the defense. That time Wooden again was defending with Tracy Graham and it's 21 yards and a first down. Well we talked about the arm strength of Todd Collins earlier in the day and here you see it. This ball probably in the air about 40 yards right on the money to Mercury Hayes and a first for Michigan. And he couldn't handle the pass. It was a little high within 10 yards. Goodness. that time, LaRon Moore, and as you can see, Bianca Batuka just ran right by him, and there's absolutely no one to cover him. LaShane Sadler doing his best to keep up. Great call by Gary Moeller to come right back to it. Collins still has it. Wide open, Reimersma for the touchdown. Great play fake by Todd Collins throws the defense, and the tight end Reimersma was all by himself for the touchdown. Collins to Reimersma for the touchdown. The tight end blocks, blocks, blocks. 
allows the coverage to pass him by, and then the celebration. Then Bianca Batuka, the man that set it up. And even Gary Moeller liked that one. 17-17. Did your mind wander back to 92? <laughs> Hit around the end. Managed to get away from that man and fumbled again. And Michigan has recovered. Second fumble of the day by Lee Beckton. Both recovered by Michigan. The last one led to a field goal. See if we can pick up who stripped it out of there. Really what happened to Lee is he landed on top of his own players on top of the pile so he wasn't down, which gave Jason Horn time to reach his hand in there and strip it away. I believe it was Jason Horn. Big turnover. Michigan will have the ball when we return. The two fumbles both were covered to the Wolverine. When you see Lou Holtz tap him on the head, he knows he has to have Lee Beckham's head in the game. Todd Collins going deep for Toomer. Collision and a flag. Obvious interference call against the Irish. 15-yard penalty on the interference for the Irish in the NFL it was in a 45-yard penalty. Toomer runs under the lobbed toss from Collins and has the Michigan first down at the 34-yard line. Looks like Sean Wood may have hurt himself just a bit. What a marvelous throw by Todd Collins. Look at the touch. Allowing Imani Toomer to just simply run out underneath this ball. And then the collapsing legs of Toomer, perfectly done. Putting a touchdown. Pitch to Davis, to Hayes on the reverse. A block from Collins. Blocker in front. Shedding his feet to the 16-yard line. Collins made a block to spring Hayes on the reverse for 18 yards. and gets it airborne and through the uprights. With 39 seconds left in the third quarter, Michigan has taken the lead. The Becton fumble again turned into a Michigan field goal. And it's 2017 Wolverines. Michigan leading Notre Dame 2017. Wolverines with a first down of their own 34. Plenty of protection for Collins, who wings it on its way complete. That'll be a first down catch by Amani Toomer. <laughs> Collins, short pass complete to Davis. And Davis with about a seven-yard gain. Into Irish territory to the 46-yard line. Bianca <laughs> nearly broke it. Up at the 35 yard line. Michigan first down. Travis Davis making the tackle. Riyaza Matuka trying the corner. Justin away from two men, then runs out of room. Out of bounds at the 32 yard line. Or will he go for it on fourth down? That appears to be his third option, the one he's choosing. He will go for it on fourth and five. at the Notre Dame 15-yard line. 15-yard strike from Todd Collins. And Amani Toomer just went nuts after he made that catch. Fourth down and five. Gary Moeller has taken so much criticism over the past couple of years. The slow start last year, getting his star players hurt in practice this year. They were ready to hang him after Tyrone Wheatley and Walter Smith got hurt in practice and now comes back with a gutsy call on fourth down to keep this drive alive. and comes away with a football. And Jeremy Naw right there again in the middle of the action. Paisley, Miller, and Mays. Miller, 
Michigan's got it. does this Notre Dame defense have left? First three up the middle. Down to the 18-yard line of the Irish. Ray has a first down. 14-yard ramble. Reverses his field. The Irish try to strip the ball away, but Bianca Batuka holds on. Batuka hit at the line and dropped in his tracks. First hit for the Irish. Wolverines third and five at the 13 of the Irish. Bianca Batuka, nothing. Driven back by the Notre Dame defense. Led by Brian Hamilton, Bianca Batuka found nothing. And another Notre Dame timeout. Keep your eye on Bobby Taylor. He's been getting close to blocking these kicks all day. Number 21 will run into your screen and jump. Hamilton to attempt it from 32 yards. Reamers mud a hole. On its way. And through. Hamilton hits the field goal. So today, three Notre Dame fumbles, all converted into field goals by the Michigan offense. Two by Becton, and the last one by Paulus. But yet, there's hope for Notre Dame. 2.15 and one timeout left, and down only six points. Ron Paulus, the young quarterback, knows what he must do. He must score a touchdown and kick the extra point for the Irish to win. Paulus Jr. telling us that his parents always got more nervous than he did, and his dad has been sort of his personal coach. The whole way to the Notre Dame tradition he must feel right now. Miller with a kickoff return. Hickson up the sideline. One man left the beach. Miller's at the 40. Out of bounds at the Michigan 35-yard line. Tyrone Noble saves the touchdown. 54 yards. Inside the 20, it covered 18 yards. For the end zone, Collins for Moe, double cover, penalty marker down, interference Michigan. Whistled against Deion Johnson. point to give Notre Dame the lead. <laughs> Stefan Schroffner, the senior kicker. <laughs> point after in the two games to date. 